adopted. Okay, I'll give you a tiny bit of this. It should help you sleep. What is it? It's cough syrup. It's not really for kids, but a capful is pretty harmless. Hmm. <laughs> oh, so this is what Lil Wayne keeps almost dying from. Oh, this is so relaxing. I could get used to this. Like the way I got used to wearing European diapers. <laughs> Yes, princess, you are free. Your nightmare is over. Oh, I'm so happy. Yes, yes. How about a kiss? What? I say, how about a kiss, yes? What? Why would I do that? What? Why would you? I, I just saved your life. Yeah, but I, I don't even know you. I rescued you. Yeah, but you expect... What? What kind of Samaritan are you? You rescued me just so you could get with me? Jesus Christ, I'm not asking you to suck at my d All I want is a kiss. Do you know what I went through to get here? Ooh, you leaped a bunch of mushrooms. I'm so impressed. Oh, well, you're the one who got captured by mushrooms. I mean, you know how the hell does that even around. happen? Don't flip this. I'm not. You got kidnapped by something that goes on a salad. Okay, it's a little more complicated. And by the way, by the way, I did not just leap a bunch of mushrooms. There were also these turtle shell things I had to jump over, and that was that was really hard. And the only help I got was every once in a while a gold star would appear up above me, and I would jump up and touch it, and it would go da da da, let that let let that let that let that let let, and then that, that would help a little bit. And I feel a little better, but it was hard. I mean, the, the whole thing was really hard. I'm not kissing you. Okay, f*** this, f*** it. Hey, dragon, you can have her. <laughs> Welcome to your new home, Bunicula. Ah, oh, he looks so sad. Where'd you find this strange cage? Well, I found it down in the basement with all that other weird stuff. No more raiding the fridge for you, little muchacho. I'm sorry, Buns, but Dad's right. If you can't be trusted, you've got to stay in here. That's it, was a serious attack! Stewie, what are you doing? Huh? Oh, Brian, oh, there you are. I've been, I've been looking all over the table for you. You know, I'm going to tell you, the stuff you gave me was a lifesaver last night. I was out like a light. And, you know, normally I'm up five or six times to scream and defecate. But you know what? I slept straight through. Stewie, I told you there's alcohol in that. It's not for kids. You're not for kids. <laughs> Stewie, you're drunk. Oh, is it? oh Brian's all serious. Oh, I don't, I don't drink in the morning because I've got to land a plane. <laughs> right, come on, i got to drive you to daycare. Okay, okay, it's all right. Uh, calm down, calm down. Uh, 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 I think I've, I think I've put my shoes on the wrong feet. Come on, Kalu, let's go to McDonald's. Oh yes. Yes, I would like a double burger with a six-piece McNugget. What? You gave me shit. Come on, try McDonald's new McShed. It has twenty percent less calories than anything in McDonald's. I don't know. It's not right for me to eat. Just eat it. I'm trying to change of Tara. No, 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 no! Brian! Brian! Hold, hold on oh, one second. I'll be right with you, Mr. Duckford. Brian! What? Let's order... I was just thinking, let's order a kebab. A what? A kebab, but I but I want it in this order: vegetable, meat, meat, vegetable, meat. And uh, Mr. Duckford would like some crackers. <laughs> Can I leave now? No, no, Brian, no, you can't, I, Brian. I need your help. I've made a series of small poops in my bath, and I need you to scoop them out with this fishnet. Yeah, I'm not doing that. You have to. You're my butler. I'm not your butler. I know, but wouldn't it be great if you were? It'd be, I'd be so happy. In fact, the only thing that would make me happier is would, is would be if this tub was filled with yogurt. Can you, can you get me some yogurt? Is the yogurt shop still open? Is there, some, is there some place to dial up yogurt? Stop saying that. What's the best skin yogurt? Who, who can prepare me a nice yogurt treatment? If you say it like that one more time, I'm going to drown you. Yogurt. Uh, see, you're not, you're not going to do anything. You're, hey, hey, Brian, am I a good little guy?
Looks like someone's in trouble. Since I can't understand you, Benicula, you're probably just making some lame excuse like, I'm a vegan. And blah, 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 it couldn't be me. <gasps> Wait a minute. You are a vegan. So, it <laughs> He's doing it. It's killing him, but he's doing it. So, as you can see, sales are going very well. Griffin, you're fired! Eh, see if I care. Hello, Cobra? I'd like to pay $1,300 for one month of health insurance. Peter, we don't have a choice. We've got to bring Eli back. Oh, no, we don't. What are you talking about? We can't be part of a feud with the Amish. I didn't start this thing, Lois, but I'm going to finish it. Joe, go round up Quagmire and all the modern-day technology you can find. We are going to war. Oh, oh, hey, Bonnie. I is Joe there? What, can I leave a message for him? Yeah, yeah, it's, it's what I said before about the, the, the war thing. All right, men, this is it. Technology versus old-timey wooden stuff. Let's hit them hard. What, again, was the nature of your beef with them? I don't know, something about a roller coaster. Let's go! Apples, fire! Quilters, advance! I bet this hurts so much. Ah! Oh, damn it, I'm bleeding. Oh, now it's an AIDS quilt. Suck on this, you furry little weirdos. Crap. Ezekiel! Call off your boys and let's you and me finish this man to man. Indeed, prepare for a goodly beating. Dad, stop! Leave him alone! Father, what are you doing? I am going to kill that man! That man is my girlfriend, Meg. <laughs> this is against everything our people stand for. Will you listen to me for one moment? You were so worried about these outsiders coming into our community and corrupting me. But look at yourself. You're the one who's allowed yourself to be corrupted. God in heaven. You are right. I am deeply ashamed. I only wanted to protect you. I know you did, Father. Kiss, 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 kiss. <sighs> Son, it is your life to live. I must accept the life you choose. I choose to stay here. What? What? Meg, you are the most beautiful woman I will ever know. You have shown me so many wondrous things that have opened my eyes to the world beyond my home. But this is where I belong. I'm sorry if this upsets you, Meg. I love you, Eli. I'll always love you. If this is what you have to do, then all I can say is I'll never forget you. I am sorry there has been conflict between us. Allow me to make amends. 
Please, help yourself to anything in my cornhole. Hey, don't worry about it. We can still be pals. And I know just a place for us to go and blow off all this steam. We went dancing. And that's all, folks. Hope you've with a pretty face. Welcome to the human.